Hey girls. I'm gonna let you out in new field. Close the gates. And open this gate. No sign of the sheep over there yet. Okay, ladies. Come on. You coming? Good girls. Good girls. Okay, leave it. Leave it, Maya. Good girls. Yeah, you're good for doing nothing at the moment. Look. <laughs> Whee! They're so happy. They're out in a big field now. Back out in a big field. And they're going to start browsing that uh, lime tree. Now, to close this gate, Now, this is the fun part. Watch this field come alive with sheep as I call them over to this gate, which is a little bit more complicated to open. Because I have this, is to block sheep from getting underneath it. No, I don't want you to go over this way. You're not to. This is gonna be for sheep. You understand, don't you? Yes, this is for sheep. <laughs> Mustard doesn't want to get dumped into the tank by an alpaca. Oh, you're going to watch out. Jumping up in an alpaca is not a good idea for a canine. It might decide to do you in. I'm sure it wouldn't, though, because it probably knows you're a puppy. Okay, here we go. This is a walnut tree. This is a lime tree. I'd say most of them are underneath that lime tree right there. If I zoom in. Come on, girls! Woo! Come on! Woo! Come on! Come on, girls! Woo! Come on! Come on! Hey, your feather. Look at this. The safety of being on this side of the gate. <laughs> Having a conversation. Now, you guys are not going into the field. Yes, you're very excited to see the sheep. Now, I've got to lift this and let the sheep in. Everybody's in now and you guys didn't get out and you didn't get put into the water tank by an alpaca. Look at you kitty. Okay. Now they're all moved into fresh field but they're all like going like hey wait a minute this isn't as fresh as we thought. Guys, there is plenty of grass in there and you've not been in this field for nearly a month. Could be even longer than a month. Okay, this is one of today's jobs done. <laughs>